All right, well, starting today, the mandatory Reds Meadow shuttle from the Adventure Center at Mammoth Mountain Ski Area through the Reds Meadow Valley ended its daily service. Now, press release notes, however, due to the extremely limited parking available in the valley, Eastern Sierra Transit Authority running a complimentary weekend intervalley shuttle service this fall. That'll be starting this Saturday and continuing through October 7th. Service will reduce vehicle congestion on the road, which has made it difficult to travel throughout the valley in previous seasons. Also, the Inyo National Forest and Devil's Postpile National Monument planning for winter on the Reds Meadow Road. Road will close at the Minaret Vista Gate on October 9th at noon. Now, the Inyo National Forest engineering staff has had to complete numerous repairs along the road in recent years. However, more extensive repairs are needed to prepare the road for the winter. Those four press releases are on SierraWave.net. Well, just an absolutely great weekend for some very fun and cool events here in the Eastern Sierra. Let's start off with the June Lake Jam Fest. This is the fourth June Lake Jam Fest. Saturday and Sunday at Goal Park June Lake Jam Fest. Oh man, Melvin Seals and JGB, the headliners, along with Cubensis and Moon Alice. Mono Council for the Arts, they're presenting this. It's a benefit for music in our schools. And again, this is Saturday and Sunday at Goal Lake Park in the June Lake Loop. You can always see uh, ticket information at June Lake Jam Fest 2018 event, uh, .com, and also Mono Arts. Arts.org will get you there for the June Lake Jam Fest. Just should be a great vibe and a whole lot of good people there celebrating June Lake Jam Fest 4 this weekend at Gold Lake. Also coming up on Saturday, hey, it's the 24th Annual Lodge Railroad Museum and Historic Sites. Good old days. Free admission. Kids are going to have all kinds of activities to enjoy themselves. They're going to have antique cars, pie auction, working exhibits, live entertainment, train barn tours, 8 a, 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. this Saturday at Laws. They also have got a coloring contest. Might want to pick up those flyers at Laws, Bishop Library, and Inyo Register and get those there before the start of the event this Saturday at 11 a.m. They are going to have community food booths, but you can picnic if you would like. Donations appreciated. It's uh, one good time if you've never been out to the 24th annual Laws Railroad Museum and Historic Site Good Old Days. You'll have a good time out there, and so will the kids. Coming up Saturday also, Picnic for the Planet, keeping the Eastern Sierra clean and green. That's going to be at Bishop City Park this Saturday, 10 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. Press release notes, Picnic for the Planet will celebrate our special Eastern Sierra landscapes and all that they provide us. Water, outdoor recreation, wildlife, agriculture, jobs, and more. Event coordinated in your 350 and Sierra Club with the help, support, and participation of many local groups and volunteers. Gladys, the Inyo County Recycloscope. Gladys is going to be there. It's quite a, well, a, a contraption is what it is. It's very cool. You can discover ways to protect our precious water, reduce trash, promote clean energy, all in support of sustainable jobs and safe and healthy communities. I think we all want that. Saturday, Bishop City Park, 10 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. And yes, the press release is on sierrawave.net. And on Sunday in Mammoth Lakes, Experience Electric should be fascinating. Mammoth Lakes resident Regine Fellows, president of the Electric Auto Association. That's the oldest and largest volunteer nonprofit promoting electric vehicles across the country. Notes there's over 80 chapters. Members regularly engage in the public to educate and advocate for EVs and with the new chapter of EAA in the Eastern Sierra. The Eastern Sierra Electric Vehicle Association headed up by President Don Condon. Hey, Mammoth Mayor Cleland Hoff, our former colleague, as well as the Mammoth Lakes Town Council, they proclaim Sunday, September 9th, EV Day in Mammoth Lakes. And we will note that the new group in Mammoth, one of five grant recipients 
for Southern California Edison from Southern California Edison for the event. The Tesla Roadster will be the pace car for the Grand Fondo uh, coming up on Saturday, September 8th. Uh, that'll start at 5 a.m. They wanted an electric car, all the bicyclists, so they didn't have to smell the fumes. The electric experience event is taking place Sunday, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Park and ride lot, Old Mammoth Road, Tavern Road, the Tesla supercharging lot. And again, we have posted that full press release, many website comments on that coming up or on uh, our website, sierrawave.net. We'll be back with a weather report.